the suburbs of Atlanta, specifically on the south side. Uh, let's talk about that. Hi, my name is Tanya Bird and I'm with Keller Williams Realty Atlanta Partners in Peachtree City, Georgia. And today we're talking about five suburbs that are south, west, kind of south of the greater Atlanta area. And leave me a comment below if you agree with this top five or if you think I left one out that deserved to be in the top five. Let's get started. Number one, Noonan, Georgia. So Noonan, Georgia is right off of I-85. Actually, 85 kind of goes through the heart of Noonan. And it is the county seat of Coweta County, has a fabulous downtown area where you can go eat at some local restaurants and do some shopping. And then it also has a fabulous mall-like setting. So if you're more into the big box stores and the chain stores to go shopping at, then you can go to Ashley Park. They also have a lot of fabulous restaurants around Ashley Park as well. Noonan's one of those towns where you can go and buy a home with an HOA, master plan community type home with, you know, golf course, swimming pools, playgrounds, things like that. Or if you're looking for a little bit more space, maybe you're looking for an acre, have their houses spread out a little bit more, or live on five acres, then you can actually find that all in Noonan. Number two, Sharpsburg. So a lot of people don't know where Sharpsburg is located, but it is located right in between Noonan and right in between Peachtree City, Georgia. You can definitely get a lot of bang for your buck in Sharpsburg. And it tends to be more rural in general. You're definitely gonna find a lot of neighborhoods that have a lot of spaces between the houses, at least on an acre of land. And it's quaint little downtown area. You could literally be driving through it and blink three times and be like, did I just go through Sharpsburg? It is that tiny. So nothing really to see much in the heart of downtown Sharpsburg. But there is a fabulous road that connects Noonan and Peachtree City and goes through Sharpsburg and that's 54 and that is where our Sam's Club is and where our Costco and there's a movie theater there. So if you need to get your book shopping on, that's where we all go. We go to Sharpsburg. Number three, Sonoya. So I had to put Sonoya on here because it is a quaint little town who has taken complete advantage of the fact that there's been lots of movies that are shot there as well as The Walking Dead. So when you go to downtown Sonoya and you can just look a stone's throw away at the set of The Walking Dead, check out my video right here so you can see more about Sonoya, Georgia. And what I'll say about the little downtown area is once you kind of get out of that downtown area, there's a lot of, there's a lot of uh, HOA-like communities there, but as you get out, it is more rural like Sharpsburg. So you can have, uh, depending on what you like, do you like houses that are more in a neighborhood like feel with amenities, or do you want a little bit more space and be out in the rural areas? Sonoya offers both. Number four, Peachtree City, Georgia. So Peachtree City, Georgia is famous for its miles and miles and miles, around a hundred, of golf cart paths. So you get to live the life at 15 miles an hour. You can drive through the Chick-fil-A or go to the Kroger in your golf cart, or if your kid's old enough to drive, they can drive themselves to the school in the golf cart. So check out the video I did here about living in Peachtree City, Georgia to check that out. It is truly a master plan community. Some of the homes have HOAs, some of them don't. It really just depends on what part of Peachtree City you're in. It is a very hard to find a lot of land in Peachtree City with a house on it. So you're definitely gonna get more into that neighborhood like feel and there's not a much new construction left. The little bit of Peachtree City that's left is being built out very quickly. Number five, Fayetteville, Georgia. So Fayetteville is the county seat of Fayette County, and it is known 
for the big movie studio that is in Fayetteville. Used to be called Pinewood, now called Trillith. And of course, it also has Pinewood Forest nearby, which is a eat, live, play, master plan community. And in today's day and age where we can work virtually from home, this would be the perfect setting to be able to work from home, go right out and eat and shop and play. The downtown area of Fayetteville also has some really cool places that you can go eat and can go shop. And you can also find more rural parts of Fayetteville. It really depends on what part of Fayetteville that you live in. So those are my top five for Fayette and Coweta County. Again, if I left one off that was your favorite, let me know in the comments below. And if you need help finding a house in any one of these areas, let me know. I'll be glad to help you out. I'll catch you all later. Bye. Thank you for watching this video and please share with the world. Connect with me. Pop on over to Facebook and like my Facebook page. Follow me on Instagram. Subscribe to my YouTube channel and connect with me on LinkedIn. And if you would like to support me, send me your referrals. I love helping people with real estate.